Isn't Bump Bob supposed to be the one on the bed about to get interrupted? Why am I on the bed about to get interrupted? Oh man, this is weird. I don't like this. Hey there, Patrick. Oh hey, Bump Bob. You seem to be in a good mood. Oh, you would be in a good mood too, Patrick, if you were a billionaire. Wait, Bump Bob, how are you a billionaire? You don't even have a job. Well, Patrick, let's just say a certain popsicle has made me lots of money. And what pop school would that be? I, I think it's pretty self-explanatory. The SpongeBob pop school. I am SpongeBob. I, I own the rights to the SpongeBob popsicle, so I get all the money from it. Well, okay, let me explain. So, Patrick, I was on my way to the bank today, only thinking I would get one cent, but no, I did not get one cent. I got one billion dollars because I started making more and more money from the SpongeBob popsicle. Oh, so more people are eating the SpongeBob Popsicle? Not exactly. You see, on TikTok, there's this tick there's this TikToker named Brent Television, and he created this trend where he's trying to find the perfect SpongeBob Popsicle, and now he's one of the most famous TikTokers on the site, and everybody wants to find the perfect SpongeBob Popsicle. Even Mr. Beast is hopping on the trend. Wait, what? Really? Even Mr. Beast? Yep, even Mr. Beast is hopping on the trend. Crazy, right? And now, you know, since I am Spongebob, I make all the money from the Spongebob popsicles, and literally everyone's been buying them, so now I'm a billionaire! <laughs> That's awesome, Bump Bob! In fact, Patrick, do you want to see all the stuff I bought with my money? Sure! No, you don't. Bro, you look so ugly, you make the Ice Age baby look like a supermodel. Look, Patrick, how about you and me get plastic surgery? Wait, what? Plastic surgery? But... Bump up. Some celebrities look horrible with plastic surgery. I mean, look at Corny Cox. She doesn't look good with plastic surgery. No, no, no. Patrick, we're billionaires. We're gonna get professionals. I mean, plus, we're 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 pl we're plushes, so we're timeless. Yeah. So uh, let let's go get plastic surgery. Yay! See, Patrick, don't we look great with our plastic surgery? Yeah, but Bump Bob, why are we so tiny? Durr! I knew I shouldn't have trusted a magician as a plastic surgeon. Wait, Patrick, why are you a why are you a superhero? Well, I'm a. Don't you remember? It's always been my dream to be a superhero. Nope, nope. I, I really, I really, I really don't remember you ever wanting to be a superhero. Clearly, you haven't played Creature from the Krusty Krab. Why would I when Battle for Bikini Bottom and the Spongebob movie game are ten times better? Okay, that may be true, but Creature from the Krusty Krab is criminally underrated. Not, I don't know. I, I, I mean, it's, it's a, it is a fun game, but I don't think you can really compare it to Battle for Bikini Bottom and the Spongebob movie um, game. Why are we even having this conversation? Oh, okay, but lights, camera, pants. And it, it may be just Mario Party with Spongebob characters, but... Oh, oh man. Oh, that game. Oh, oh yeah. Oof, that was, that was fun. But anyways, Patrick, looky, looky what I got. <laughs> Bum -bum. you own Glove World now? Yep, that's right. I own an amusement park. I have made my own amusement park and I've named it Glove World. But why did you name it Glove World? I don't know, I just think it's a really lovely name. <laughs> Did you seriously name it that just so you can make that pun? Yeah. I named it that, that was, I can make that pun, Patrick. But, Patrick, me being a billionaire has turned out for the better of us. Look, Patrick, I, I feel healthier. My, my anxiety's gone. I'm not angry all the time. I'm, I'm not spending all my time watching TV. This is, this is a new chapter. I'm rich now, Patrick. Wow, Bump Bob. Usually in Super Mario Logan videos, the characters get really greedy when they become rich. But you, you have become a better person, Bump Bob. Yeah. My gloating days of o are over, honestly. Like, re you know, remember when I got that YouTube channel? Oh, God. My, my ego. My, my ego was, like, off, off the roof. It was, like... 2018 Logan Paul level. Yeah, your ego was pretty high, Bob Bob. 
Yeah, but those days are over. I'm a changed man, and now I own the Krusty Krab. But I thought Mr. Krabs owned all the Krusty Krabs. Nope, now I own all the Krusty Krabs, so I get most of the money. Wait, so Bump Bob, are you just gonna keep buying companies? Yep, like Disney, I'm just gonna buy everything. You know how rich I'm gonna be, Patrick? Well, wow, Bump Bob, that's really cool. In fact, it's so cool, I think I could fly about it. But Patrick, I, I would not recommend flying. Why? I, I, ju I, ju I just got a good feeling. Oh, come on, Bump Bob. What's the worst thing that could happen? Oh, no. Oh, I'm about to fly into Jimmy Hendrix. Ow, that really hurt. Yep, that, that's what I was trying to warn you about, Patrick. In fact, you know, a lot more birds have actually been dying because they've been crashing into Jimi Hendrix. And that's kind of why I didn't want you to fly. I didn't want you to crash into Jimi Hendrix. There, there's even been way, way more plane crashes and helicopter crashes and even more blimp incidents because everyone has just been crashing into Jimi Hendrix. I think Jimi Hendrix owes me an apology. Excuse me, Mr. Hendrix, but... <laughs> Jimmy, you may be the greatest guitar player of all time, but that doesn't give you the excuse of... <laughs> oh, Don't worry, Patrick. I'll pay for hospital bills, after all. I... I am a billion... I am a billionaire, after all. Yeah, e Elon Musk, Jeff Bezos, Bill Gates... Y'all, y'all got competition. You hear me? You know how there's all these like YouTuber and there's like a, even YouTubers versus TikTokers. Yeah, how, how about SpongeBob versus billionaires? Yeah, I want, I want to fight all of you. Y'all, y'all are an old man. I'm, the, I'm the new young hip billionaire. Mhm. Mm y'all, y'all better, y'all better make way. Mhm. Mm I'm a billionaire and I'm gonna beat all, all y'all old billionaires up. Yeah, I mean y'all, y'all still awesome. I'm just, I'm just playing, but. Still, yeah, look me, look at me, look at me in my cartoon eyes. Look me in my eyes. <laughs> so, Patrick, do you want to try out any of the any of the rides for filler? Oh, uh, I don't know. Oh, come on! How about you give the rides a try, you sly dog, you? Okay. Oh no. The fiery fist of pain! Oh! Okay, this isn't so... Oh no. Why me, God? Why me? Oh! Ow, 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 ow. Oh! Why, Bob, Bob, why? Why would you have a ride where you literally get hurt? It's it's okay it's okay the the rest of the the rest of the rides aren't aren't like that why don't you why don't you uh, go on the Ferris wheel Patrick okay <laughs> this amusement park was perfect now I get to watch Patrick get hurt after all the misery he's put me through <laughs> I guess we'll go on the Ferris wheel hmm. oh no not the Ferris Bueller's day off wheel oh. <laughs> It's fast! It's fast! It's fast! It's so fast! Why is it so fast, Bump Bob? Why? Bump Bob, I didn't really like that ride either. Oh, come on, Patrick. How about you just try the tunnel of glove and then the spinny thingy? Okay, Bump Bob. Okay, this is. This is so bad, so far! Ah! Ah! This is a fever dream! Bull ah! Bob, you promised that ride was be was fun. I did not appreciate any of those images in that tunnel. Bull Bob, how are you not how, how are you not caught by the FBI after the images you've showed me? Just, let's try the spinny thingy, alright? <laughs> this is fun. I'm a billionaire and I get revenge on Patrick. Bump Bob, why did you put me right next to the Wusty Web? You'll see, Patrick, you'll see. <laughs> I don't like where this is going. Oh no, no, no. Please, Bump Bob. Ow! 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 Oh, oh. Bump Bob. Ow, you're slamming me into the crusty crap, Bump Bob. Ow! Bump Bob, you're slamming me into the hole.
Popo, why do I feel like you you took me here just so you could hurt me? No, Patrick. I mean, I did legitimately buy it because, well, I'm a, I'm a billionaire and I want to make tons of money off this. But uh, no, that's definitely uh, I, I definitely I definitely did not tell you to go on the ride so you you could get hurt or anything. Okay, Popo, I trust you. I'm sorry that the rides were uh, painful. <laughs> It's okay. Knock on the door. I have to go get that, Patrick. Hey, uh, when did you guys become tiny? Oh, well, you see, we got plastic surgery. P what plastic surgeon did you go to? They you literally shrinked. Wait, is there a plastic surgeon where I can become taller? They always, I could be the best basketball player and won't have to run a million jobs and I can actually do something that I'm passionate about. Nope. I, I think the plastic surgeon can only shrink you that we went to. Damn it. What good is, sh what good is being short anyway? <sighs> Whatever. Seriously, th there's no way you guys actually went to a legitimate plastic surgeon that shrinked you. You, you guys probably went to a magician. Not a plastic surgeon or a mad scientist. Well, whatever. That's besides the point, but, uh, Spongebob, you are under arrest. What? Why am I under arrest? Well, there have been numerous reports that you have been running sweatshops to make the Spongebob popsicles, and that the Spongebob popsicles have been made out of actual sponges, which does explain why you are the only sponge in the su in, uh, Super Mario Hayden City. That's ridiculous! All the sponges are in Bikini Bottom! I moved to Super Mario Hayden City because, well, to get away from the crime. Yeah, I don't believe that. In fact, a legitimate lawyer named Jerry actually told me about this. That's why did Jerry become a lawyer? Well, SpongeBob... The reason why I haven't been tormenting you lately is because I have been going to law school. Wait, but why? That way I could sue you for all your money. But how did you knew I was how did you know I was going to become rich? Let's just say I was a writer for the Simpsons and I could predict the future. That's ridiculous! Of all people, why did you have to be a writer for the Simpsons? <laughs> well, take him away, Goofy. Well, you know what? I will give you a choice. Either you could keep your money, or you will get a severe punishment. Oh, okay. This... This punishment can't be that bad. Well, what's the punishment? Well, either you keep all your money, or you have to watch every single Coco Melon video that was uploaded to YouTube. Huh? Every single Coco Melon video uploaded to YouTube? Oh no! Yeah, that's right. So what's it gonna be, SpongeBob? Jail, Coco Melon, or keep all your money and get the electric chair. Wait, well, actually, no. Either you keep all your money but have to watch every single Coco Melon video, or you just, well, go to jail for about a month. Go to jail for about a month. Good answer. Oh, and now I get to keep I own the SpongeBob Popsicle Company or Popsicle. Sorry. Talking is a bit hard for me. Since I am a mouse, I'm used to squeaking. That's ridiculous! As soon as life starts to take a turn for me, this happens. You know what? I don't want the glove world or the crusty crab business. In fact, I would like to tip them, or flip them. Flip them? Yeah, kind of like cow tipping, but with actual businesses. Okay, 
suit yourself. Uh, I think I'm gonna fly away from this bump bump. We Ah, Jimi Hendrix, why? Okay, SpongeBob. No. You know you're not actually gonna do it, right? No, my glove world. No! Ow! Ow! And now I'm not rich anymore, so I don't have my hospital bills! Ow! Ugh, now. Now for the crusty crab. No, please have mercy. <laughs> Life is good.